This is Die Sporting Network. What, what? Hello, everybody. Welcome you back. Get to the Die Sporting Network here at Patterson's Gymnasium on the east side of Baltimore. No question about it. The Patterson Clippers ranked in the top five in both the Baltimore Sun and Varsity Sports Net poll. Getting ready to take on Aberdeen out of Hawford County. The Eagles had a record of 0-1 in their road uniforms today in the blue. Lost to Elton by 20, 57-37 here last week. Patterson season was delayed and they started it as the Eagles get it first. Hayes back over. Starts over. That's a, almost a turnover. No. Rogers for three. Got it. So the senior guard gets going there for Pat with Aberdeen. Addison, like we were saying, their season was delayed. Then they got going, and they really got going against Archbishop Curley over the weekend. Thomas back over is going to Mount Sinai Prep next year. Floats it inside there. No good. Ball out of bounds. Nice hustle there by Marsalis Carroll to sink. The senior center. And with 718 left. Thomas will inbound for Patterson. Back over. Blackwell for three. That one didn't go. Offensive rebound to the transfer from Joppa Town. Jalen Wills. And he pushed the two in to get it going for Patterson. Both teams' second game of the season. There's Mo Whitley with it now for Aberdeen. Marvin Price back in town from. West Virginia, and that's an offensive foul there. It's Jared Mungo, seen him for the last couple years. Got a unique story, he's going along with college, I believe, next year. We're gonna get a confirmation on that shortly. Thomas, back over to Mungo. Mungo puts it up, that one tipped and missed. Wills back over, puts it in. Four points so far from Jalen Wills. 4-3 game for Patterson. Swings it back over, Rogers shot the three before, but he lost it out of bounds that time. And the ball's going back to the Clippers. Go brings it up. Brandon. Wills again dips. Price from downtown. Tipped and miss. Nice save, but he was out of bounds. And the Eagles get it back. Six minutes here left in the first quarter. Hayes gives it up to William Bush, back over to Hayes. That's a three from Whitley, that one tipped and missed. The rebound over to Jalen Wills. Emil, back to Price. Price inside, he's coming up to shoot two. Marvin Price back in town from, uh, from Huntington Prep in West Virginia. Back for his senior years and when Patterson Two years ago, won the 2A state title. But the year ago, the Clippers had a lot of injuries, but they're back in business this year, looking to rebound and win the city title as well as win the state title. Both shots missed, tipped out of bounds. Patterson should keep it, they will not, and Aberdeen will get it back. So Mo Whitley gets the basketball. And bounds as Aberdeen down by one. Play in the UCBAC. Turned it over. Blackwell all alone and one. So Blackwell at the line shooting the and one. Legos in the game. 
for Aberdeen. Deanne one here to put the Clippers up four. That one tipped and missed. So Whitley brings it up. Pressured in the center court. Somehow the Eagles still get it. And hits it. How about that from William Bush? Puts that two in. And it's a one-point game. Mungo. Back over. Price and now Thomas. Mungo in the corner from Price. He hits it. A nice three. And a 9-5 advantage for Patterson. Trying to get the steal. Jump ball is called. One well, for saying Patterson gets it. And the Clippers will get it. Price over to Thomas. Over to Blackwell. Over to Mungo here. Thomas. That's jumper, Mungo, no good. Offensive rebound to Thomas. Offensive foul. And the ball back over to Aberdeen. We've seen Patterson in the summertime grind league, which they won that league. And we've seen Patterson in the Curly Fall League, which they was the runner up to Newtown in that. So Patterson looking strong in the, in the off season time and they want to get it going in season. That was a tip out of bounds. The ball will stay with the Eagles on their end. Aberdeen getting on the young season, trying to rebound. William Bush, that one tipped and missed. And a foul against Patterson. Second team foul against the Clippers. And a timeout by the Clippers. Yeah, 9-5 game. As we're a little bit in the first quarter, almost about the halfway mark. Here on the Dice Running Network. And again, check out videos. Got the matchups over the weekend from the IABO Board 23 Challenge. Got some games on that one. Also got games from uh, the BCL, WCAC, John City Challenge as well in the Dice Running Network. So check them out. We got more videos coming at you. Here in December and in January is a busy month for us, and we will be coming at you from the various tournaments coming up in the new year. So check us out and check out the official Facebook page, the High Sporting Network. Right now, William Bush and his Eagles, as Whitley got the ball now, they're trying to cut into this Patterson lead, which is only a four point deficit for them. William Bush inside. Tip got his own ball back. Shot clock and a foul inside. Wave off the basket. It's a foul against the Clippers. 13 foul against Patterson. So Jermaine Stewart will inbound for Aberdeen. ML picked off. Blackwell going coast to coast. Got another two in. 11 5 game. Stewart back over. That's a three from Whitley. An air ball. Jump ball. And I believe the ball will stay with Aberdeen. Yep, Aberdeen will get it back. 11-5 game. 351 here left in the first quarter. Full shot clock. Ball's about to be in about it. And head coach Henry Martin made this Patterson team into a power. Into a good program that has done well over the last eight years. Inbounds. William Bush. Over to Stewart. William Bush inside. Got it in there. 11 7 game as Blackwell brings it down the court again. Mungo. Old serve. And kicks it over to Thomas. 
Thomas Bademongo again. Almost got it stolen. Mongo got it back, swings over. That's a three from Blackwell. That one tipped and missed. Rebound over to Stewart. Stewart brings it over to William Bush. He brings it up. Back over to Whitley now in the corner. And got it by Mongo. Back at the top of the key is Stewart. Stewart lost off his lead. Wells slams it down. Jalen Wells used to seeing that a lot out there in Hartford County and now here in Baltimore City. Doing it against one of his former rivals out there. Back over inside, offensive foul. As Kell tried to position himself and the ball back to Patterson. And as they say, a momentum swift indefinitely. Mongo brings it up. 13-7 game, six point lead for Patterson. The top three team in the Fossey Sports Net Bowl. Number four in the Baltimore Sun. Swings it back. That's a three. That's an air ball there from Thomas. Back over. Pick City. Thomas redeemed himself. Dish. Price gets it in. That was nice. A timeout by Aberdeen. And an eight point lead for Patterson. That's the Clippers looking good here in the early going. Come at you. So you check out the flex zone, of course, episode 211. Dale, guys from the offseason. Voice of WBGR Sports Network. Also going to talk a little wild finishes in the NFL. How about this week there? And also Urban Meyer, or as I like to call him on the show, Urban Liar. So the flex song, you can sports how you want to you need it every Monday night, 10 p.m. on the WBGR Sports Network Facebook Live page as well as the Flex Zone Facebook Live page. William Bush had inbounded over to Stewart. Stewart brings it up. And it gets picked off by Nunzen. Back over. Mungo lays it in. Pressure defense. Another steal. And John Thomas, the freshman, puts it in. 19-7 advantage here. Aberdeen having a hard time getting it up from half court. Dips back over. That's a three from Stewart. Hits it a big time shot there. And that gets Aberdeen with a nine. But they got to stop turning it over because Marvin Price, that one tipped and missed. Do stuff like that. How about Jalen Wills to really make dividends on this team? William Bush off the fast break. Whitley, the reversal, went up too high for it. And a push off against Aberdeen. Third team foul against the Eagles at the first quarter. Coming to a close, 123 left here in the quarter. Jared Mungo with it. Hello to the junior. Nunes. Swings back over to, to Mungo. Price got it again. Price going in. Back over to Mungo. He fakes the shot. He pulls up and he hits. Jared Mungo the senior. Looking good there as we're down to seconds left here in the first. Back over to Hayes. Hayes fakes it and turns it over. Mungo leading the fast break. Then the ball's on the deck. And Patterson's still able to retain. Price, he's going coast to coast. Nice dish, blocked away. And back over to Aberdeen. Swains lost the handle. There was Kell and a turnover. Clippers get it back. John Jones in the game. Marvin Price of Breaver. Mm -hmm. 
Mungo brings it up. 25 seconds left. That's a three. That one's high in the miss. Offensive rebound to Jones. Back over. Nunez pushed the two in. 11 10 9. And throws it away. Eight seconds left exactly, and the ball back to Patterson. Jalen Wells looking good. Mungo brings it up. Five, four, three. Mungo from way downtown, front end miss. The shot will not count, did not go off in time. Did not go off in time. So after one, Patterson looking good at home, second home game here. And they're up by 13 over Aberdeen, 23 to 10. Right now, Jalen Wells, the transfer from Jamba Town, has really made dividends in his game so far. He's got six of the 23 points, but his activity and his familiarness with Aberdeen, since they played him a lot out there in Jamba Town, is huge. And him, the combination of Blackwell, Thomas, and Mungo, Price, of course, four guard. So almost a five guard set. Using the best lineup to the ability as the second quarter will begin with Mungo inbound the ball. Back over to Thomas, Tyrone Thomas, that is. And we've got two Thomases now on the Patterson team. Mungo has it. Shot clock at 23. Price. Looking to shoot, not there. That's a three. That one tipped and missed. Grand rebound there by Abram. And a foul against the Clippers. Jameer William Bush will inbound for Aberdeen. Rogers had that opening three. Haven't heard much from him since. Over to Hayes. Back over to Bush Williams. To Williams Bush, excuse me. That's a three from Rogers. Speaking of it, that one tipped and missed. Rebound to Tyrone Thomas. He brings it up, swings it right over to Mungo. Mungo back over to, to Thomas. Thomas back to Blackwell and scores. 15 point advantage here for the clip crew. Pick City by Blackwell. He's got six points. Oh, counted him too soon. Marvin Price puts it in. 27-10. Back over. And another turnover. Here comes Patterson again. Oh, what a move. And Tyrone Thomas finishes the job. 29-10 and a push off against Patterson. I'll tell you. Double T split the middle and laid it in on his opponent. And substitution in. Noble in the game. Hayes. Driving and a foul. So 16 foul against pass and one more. Aberdeen to be shooting uh, the one and one, which right now looks like a distant memory. There in this one. Back over. To Hayes, he brings it up for Aberdeen. 
19 point lead. Inside, Kell did not go. And back over to Mongo. Oh, inside. Woo, how about that again? Mr. Blackwell putting it in. 31 10 game. Patterson looking good. And his second home game. Lost the handle. Patterson gets it back. 6 0 2 here left in the half. A game where Aberdeen early was able to hold things down a little bit, but the defense, Price in the middle, that one's been out. Tapped out of bounds, is going to stay with Patterson. The defense of Patterson's been so good here in the first half. Been able to pressure Aberdeen into several errors. That's a three from Blackwell. Hits it. 34-10. That's the Clippers. Looking to roll here. Spin move by Hayes. Kicks it back over. Hayes got it. Hayes pulls up for three and hits. Hits for Aberdeen. 34-13 game. That was wild and a turnover. Hayes able to keep it for Aberdeen. Hayes all the way, missed it high, and a foul is called. So the 17th foul against Patterson. That'll put Aberdeen at the line, and they'll be shooting two in this instance, but they'll be either one and one until the 10th foul is committed. First shot here for Kell. In there. Second shot, got it. Both shots go to 34-15 game. Back over to Mungo from Nunez. Price pulls up again for that mid-range. That one tipped and missed that time. Ball's grabbed up. And the ball's going back to Aberdeen as Elijah Abraham inbounds the basketball over the Legos. Hayes brings it up now. Single point guard. Trying to get into the spot. Does. That was a air ball. From Avon. Fast break. Tom Thomas. Nunez couldn't handle it. Mungo from top of the key. That one's bent in and out. Stolen by Thomas. No good. Price cleans it up. And puts it in. 36 15. 4 19 left here in the first half. Hayes brings it up here for Pat, for Aberdeen, excuse me. Picked off. Thomas Price. Nunez, two points. Timeout again by Aberdeen. Lead us up to 23. 38 15, right at. The four-minute walk, 4-1 to be precise here in the first half. Back to game action. Once again, DeMars Dye, Alexander Johnson, AJ with you. And Stewart will inbound with 4 one here left in the half for Aberdeen. Eagles trying to get the offense going, but they got to hold on to the basketball. That has been the thing that has really stymied them here in the first half. But Patterson's defense, to their credit, they'll do that to you. Rogers in the corner for three. That one tipped and missed. Carroll tried to save it to Novell. 
Nunez picked off. Back over to Stewart inside. Mr. Duncan's curl. Oh, Mungo behind his back. Fast break. That's how you finish it off there. Anderson puts it in. Price grabs it, brings it up the court. Oh, inside, another two points. 27 point advantage. And the cheap foul by Nunez that will put Aberdeen at the line to shoot the one and one. Three eleven left here in the first half. First shot here from Hayes. Got it. Second shot here coming up. Second shot, front end miss. Marvin Price with the rebound. Inside, blocked by Kell, but tapped in inside. John Thomas didn't get the roll. Price gets the finish, though. A 28 point advantage for the Clippers. So you ride one of the top teams in the land. Back over. That's a three. That one's spent in and out. Back over to Patterson. Nunez looking all the way. A fake, and he puts it in. Lanondre Nunez with the drop there. And uh, it's a 30-point lead, 46-16. Patterson is rolling in this one. Takes it back over. Hayes with it again for Aberdeen. Swing out of bounds. It was tapped though. Seven seconds left on the shot clock. Two or six left in the game clock here for Aberdeen to do something with it. So Jeremiah Stewart will inbound the ball. Flies it over to Hayes. Double team. And a foul. Nunez very quickly has two fouls here. And at the free throw line, it's going to be the one and one again for Aberdeen. There's an active shooting. First shot didn't go. Second shot here. Got it. No more. He was found at the three-point line. That one missed. Two down over the wheels. Up the court there. John Thomas. That's a three. He has missed it. Price is trying to grab the rebound, but it tapped out of bounds on him and is back to the Eagles. 140 left here in the first half. Can't get too much better what we've seen out of Patterson. Travel. Ball back to Patterson. Wolves brings it up. Price. Try 
Drive inside, that one tipped and missed, offensive rebound. Price with the strong man move, and one. Coming up to shoot the and one, and uh, Patterson trying to hit the 50 mark before the half. In there, 49-17 game. Here for the home team, the Clippers. For three for Hayes, got it. Wilts brings it down. They trying to end the hat off on a strong note. And Price does with a three. 52-20. Patterson's hit the 50 mark here in the first half. Looking still. Swings it to William Bush. He's wide open for three. And that one tipped and missed. Offensive rebound. That one didn't go. Guess who got it? Marvin Price with the rebound. Price brings it up. Swings it over. That's a three. That one tipped and missed there from Anderson. Count it! No, they say wave it off. They're saying wave the basket off. It was interference. So the ball back to Aberdeen. 6.7 seconds here left in the half. Referee's getting together. The foul do count, so it's going to be two shots from Marvin Price. 6.7 left. The basket itself will not count. Price at the line. Missed the first. Second shot. Got it. Timeout with 6.7 left. Coach Martin and a Talking on over with his team. 30, quick 30 second timeout here for the Clippers. And the next time you will see us, it's going to be a split bill here on the Dinosaur Network. I'll be at Polly and Lake Clifton next Monday. And what a matchup that's going to be. That's one of Polly's only defeats last year in Baltimore City play. Is that Lake Clifton? They get to rematch the Clippers again there. And my man. AJ, Alexander Johnson, he will be at Epperson watching Patterson play Epperson in that one. So we're going to have a split bill for you next week. Highlights of that Patterson Epperson game coming your way, and then full game of Lake Clifton and Polly coming up on the Dice Wing Network next Monday. So, turned over. Patterson ends the half off well. And that's it at the buzzer. So at halftime, Patterson put up an NBA-like score at halftime, 55 to 20 over Aberdeen in the second half. We with some thrills and highlights. You know all that's coming your way too here on the Dinosaur Network. We'll be back. of the second half and uh, Patterson put up 55 points in the first half and they really controlled the contest against Aberdeen. I mean, everybody got into the active scoring in the second half. Expecting kind of the same. You know, Aberdeen, see some fight out there starters and 
They definitely want to come out before they get to Howard, Hawford County play, excuse me. Try to see what Coach Shelby got from his team. Thomas back to Blackwell. Tyrone Thomas, that is. Oh. That's a three, hits it. Blackwell, the junior, dropping it in. That's a three the other way. No good there from William Bush. Back comes Patterson. Mungo swings it over. Price from downtown. That one tipped and missed. Back comes Hayes of Aberdeen. Oh, he fakes himself. Wills. Gets off the turnover, back over to Price, lays it in. A one-two punch. Might see a lot of that this year. But Jalen Wills and Marvin Price. Hayes from downtown. No good. Mungo with the rebound under the basket. Swings it over to Blackwell. He pulls back. Back over to Tyrone Thomas. Wilts in the teeth. Got partially blocked there by Kell. And Aberdeen gets it back. A 40-point advantage right now as Williams Bush gets the two. Tom Thomas. That's a three, and that's a hit for Blackwell. 41-point advantage. Inside, layup is good there by Marcellus Carroll. Tyrone Thomas brings it up. Back over to Mungo, back over to Price. Price fakes, swings over. Thomas back over to Price, he pulls up. And front end miss, offensive rebound. There to Tyrone Thomas. Swings it back over to Wilkes. Price in the teeth of the defense in the middle. And that one didn't go for him. Oh, what a steal by Mungo and two points for him. Another timeout. Coach Martin, 65-24 game. And Patterson getting ready for Baltimore City play after this one. And they will be in the thick of Baltimore City play. Like I said, here on the Dice Way Network this year, you will hit Patterson several times. And the teams will be really following this year. And we will see them in matchups against uh, Edmondson, City, Pally, Dunbar, Mervo, Morgan Park at the uh, Charm City, Windy City Challenge. We'll be there for that one. And the Baltimore Hoops Festival with uh, Calvert Hall there. So, and Mount Kelmo as well in the end of January as well. So we will see Anderson quite a bit. Hold the ball in. Back over to Hayes and the Eagles. Jumper in and out. That three. Kell with the offensive rebound and the two. Two point goes. Blackwell bangs it up. Swings it back over to Tyrone Thomas. Over to John Thomas. Ball tapped out of bounds. And the ball's gonna stay with Patterson. 5.04 left in this one, 11 on the shot clock. That's the bad news as you gotta bring the ball up from full court. Gotta commit the offense pit. Price. Swings it over. Wilds shoots it. That one front end miss. Williams Bush gets it. Starts the fast break, but got picked off. Tyrone Thomas brings it up. Cuts over. Blackwell saved it from going out of bounds. John Thomas back to Tyrone Thomas. Tom Thomas again. He gets it in. A little action from the freshman there getting it two. Swings back over. That's a three. And hits from Rogers. This second three of the contest. 
67-29 as Patterson looking to start 2-0. Price gives it up. Tyrone Thomas with it. Price back over. Price with the floater and hits. 69-29. Full three left. Kicks it back over. Pick off. Blackwell. Back over to Tyrone Thomas. He pulls back. John Thomas couldn't finish it. Back the other way. Swings it back over. Rogers drives. Missed it high off the glass. Rogers had tapped off his hand. And Patterson gets it back. Blackwell back to Tyrone Thomas. Price. Swings it back over to John Thomas. That's a drive inside. Ah, didn't go. John Thomas with the offensive board. Ah, he didn't get the and one, but shooting two. So two shots for John Thomas here at the line. And Thomas right now looking very impressive here. First shot. Miss. BKD-TV is the website where sports lives. You check out articles on BKD-TV. NFL articles mostly. Catch up with some of the flex on stuff during the holidays. Get that updated as well on a couple of other articles. BKD-TV is a website where sports lives. Second shot here from Thomas. John Thomas, that is. Got it. So one of two. And it's a 70 to 69, 29 game, excuse me. Hayes, back over to Williams Bush. Dry and a foul. First team foul against Patterson. So it was in the act of shooting, so he's shooting two. First shot spins out. Second shot, yes sir. 70, 30. Price swings it back over. Price from the top of the key, three. That one tipped and missed. Back comes Hayes and the Eagles. Swings it back, that's a three. That was air ball. Back then. Nunez behind his back. Nice pass inside. And a two goes in. That was a nice one. Williams Bush. Jalen Williams. And the ball taken away. Double dribble with 157 here left in the third. And Patterson gets it back. Pulls up as Hayes. Over to Williams. And a foul. Second team foul against Aberdeen as uh, Nunez will inbound. Over to Blackwell. Nunez back over to Blackwell, swings over to Price. Price inside, face, tried to get the finish, grabs the rebound, puts the two out. That's how you want to do it right there.
Hayes. That's a three. Off the top of the backboard, no good. Nunez brings it up for Patterson and a foul. Price gets it in. Shot clock is off. Clock is a running clock at this point because of the score. Price going to hold for the last shot of the quarter. That's a screen and a foul. That's it. That's the end of three. And at the end of three, Patterson will be 2-0 and at this full quarter. So they're up 74-30 here over Aberdeen in this one. Thing we want to see here, passing get to the century mark. And this one, but coming up next week, we'll see Patterson again. Split bill for us against Edmondson. And my man AJ Alexander Johnson will be at Edmondson for that one. And I will be at Lake Clifton watching Polly meet up with Lake Clifton. That game was stopped a year ago as Lake Clifton was credited to win. Polly would love some revenge in that one. So we got a split one. Next week on the Dice Swing Network, right before the holidays. And after that one, City and, and Patterson right back here at the Clipper Court. They will meet each other as well to have our coverage right before the holidays here on the Dice Swing Network. So action coming up at you. As we come back right now, Aberdeen. Stewart was dribbling, trying to make something happen and that's not bad there by Jalen Williams Mungo back over to Wells what a pass there Tyrone Thomas Blackwell spins out the three back over to Kell turn the ball 32 and a turnover ball went over Lego's hands To no avail. Seven minutes left in this one. Patterson on their way to being 2 0 oh here on the young season. Price. That's a three from Mungo. That one hits the back on. Rebound by Wells. Wells kicks it back to Blackwell. Blackwell for three. Hits it. 77-32. A 45-point advantage here for Patterson. And again, that's the second team is about to come on in. He said before. Pick City. Wills. Back over. Ali! Oh, tried a little theatrics there, which I don't mind. That was out. Mocking foul against Patterson, 13 foul. Clock continues to run with six minutes left. Substitutions in, the starters coming out for Patterson. Their day is completed. Well, it should. They had a very magnificent afternoon. Get some rest. We got a match of them all with Southwestern Patterson Duke. First road game of the season. That two goals in 77-34. Nunez brings it up. Off the body, 
And a turnover. Swings it the other way. Here comes Carroll. Jump ball. Jump ball. Let's see with the current. It is going to go to Patterson. 4.55 left in this one. Anderson. Swings it over. Nunez from downtown. That one was no good. Offensive rebound from Noble. That one did not go. And a foul is called. 14 foul against Patterson. So Robinson gets it. This fourth quarter, of course, is Garbo's time, and the great Marv Robert was there. Seeing what, what you got here. Williams, Jalen Williams, it is over to Whitley. Whitley looking to do something. Swings it back. Swings it over. Inside. That one goes in. Nice one there from Robinson. Quick timeout. 3.43 left. A 41 point advantage for Patterson. And it's Clippers again. Will we going to 2 0? You stay with us through this very entertaining one. We thank you so much, Ian, the Dice Network. Right subscribe now. Check out all the videos here from the last several years of basketball action here in your way. You should come back. The last 3.43 left in this one. Anderson with it. Over to Blackwell, back over to Nunes. Blackwell from downtown. Hits it. 80 points up on the board here for Patterson. Robinson. Jalen Williams. That's a steal. Blackwell all the way to the basket in there. 82 36, three minutes left for Sackley. Drive inside Whitley, he gets it in there. 82 38. That's a wide open three for Nunez. That one tipped and miss. Fighting for the rebound there. A jump ball, and it's going to go to Aberdeen. Swings it back over. Whitley pulls up. That one tipped and missed. Ball's going to go to Patterson. Substitution as Taylor comes in the game for Aberdeen. 216 left. Back over, that's a long distance one. Blackwell showing his range as he hits that one right from the P off the Clippers on the court. 85-38. That's a three attempt, that tipped and miss. Blackwell over to Nunes. Nunes at the Blackwell. Why not? Show it from that range. Hits it again. Hits it again. And it's a 50 point advantage as Blackwell has really gone hot from the three ball. Looking for the steal, uh, reaching 15 foul against Patterson. Good point. I don't think that's going to count. See if they can get it to 90. 90 38 advantage. Let's see if Patterson can get it there. They're two points away from getting 
90 points. They scored 95 against Archbishop Curley on Saturday. That's a drive. Back over. That's a three. That one tipped and missed. Out of bounds. Ball back to Patterson. Well, it just will be Patterson's last opportunity to get that uh, that 90 up. First two games, 95 and 90 points. That's a pretty good accomplishment if that can happen. Shot clock, game clock. Blackwell, why not? That one tipped and missed. Got the save. And not quite there. John Jones got it. Blackwell's going to dribble it out. So in the first two home games for Patterson, they put up 95 against Archbishop Curley. And then this one, unless a shot is made, which will not be attempted, they put up 88. And a 50-point win against Aberdeen. And the Clippers ranked in the top five in both Baltimore Sun Frosty Sports Net Poll. They will go to 2-0. Aberdeen will suffer their suffer defeat, and they'll get the heart for county play. They're going to drop the 0-2. We're coming up with the post game shortly here. Interview with Coach Henry Martin of Patterson. That's coming up here on the Dine 20 Network. Stay tuned. Back here in the post game, Patterson's 50 point win over Aberdeen. Got Marvin Price here. Welcome back to town, first of all, man. And 21 points tonight. What you like from your game tonight that translated? Uh, tonight, I just like the shot really wasn't falling. My teammates kept encouraging me, though, kept telling me to shoot, so I was able to get a few putbacks to get going in the second quarter and second half. Gotcha. And watching you guys, how, how was it to see um, Sirius Blackwell, 27 points, that three ball was hitting? I know I know it was good to see him do well tonight and move on from there, right? Uh, yeah, it was, it was definitely good to see him shoot like that because – he works on the shot a lot, so to see it fall in the game, that's that's good, and hope he keeps it up because we we gonna need that, especially later on in the season. Question about it. now, I was there two years ago at Lake Clifton when you dominated Lake Clifton inside in that third quarter, amazement. And you got Edmondson next week. We're gonna see you there. What you got coming up? We expect to see from some of the major city schools, Polly, of course. We know got a loaded team. I know you're familiar with them very much, and and Lake Clifton as well. Um, well. We just coming to win. We we just coming to take it all. We're not really worried about any other teams. We know we know if we play our game, it's it's just gonna come easy. Hey man, 95 points first game, 88 second. I know you love the high tempo. Yeah, we just we trying to get up and down as fast as we can because if we play our game, nobody can really play with us. We try not to fall in the hands of other teams. Gotcha. Well, Marvin, I ain't gonna hold you up no more, man. What I said, welcome back in town. Y'all look good today, man. Good luck to you. And that's Marvin Price there. Senior guard from Patterson and the Clippers. Like we said, 27 points from Blackwell. Marvin there had 21. They look great tonight. And we'll see them next week against Edmondson. And we'll see Polly play Lake Clifton as well. Two huge Baltimore City Division I matchups coming up at you on the Dice Morning Network next week. So, of course, you subscribe to the page. Check out the Twitter at Dice Morning Net. And our official Facebook page, Dots on the Net, where you can see some of the stuff premiere and come to the YouTube page and check it out. So for my man, AJ, Alexander Johnson, I'm DeMars Die. We will see you next week here on the Dots on the Network and down the road, too. So long.